ourselves new Danmachi content. Another trailer for season 5 of Danmachi. And I think that other gray hair girl is super important in the bar, right? The feelings of a girl is released. <laughs> Can I invite Bell to the Goddess Festival? But it says, it says Goddess of Fertility. Right? For, isn't that the uh, really, really attractive girl that's been kind of like on... Like, Freya. Freya, that's her name, right? She's been pretty much hinted as one of the most important beings in season one, but has gotten a little bit of screen time. That's fucked up. That, that's fucked up. Season four, this poor girl was in the fucking dungeon with Belle, just like trying to survive, had such intimate moments, then you show up out of fucking nowhere. And just take Bell? What is that? How is that possible? The amount of intimacy that Bell and Ryu shared together in season four, all god, because of one fucking arc? I don't know how that's possible. Yeah, also new design for Ryu. New design for Ryu. She even growing that hair out. Did Bell say that he likes, you know, girls with longer hair? Imagine she intensely grew the hair out just to impress Bell, and then this bitch fucking shows up out of nowhere. Oh, girls. <laughs> Hestia just might be the most cucked waifu in anime. I'm not sure if that's... <laughs> I know Belle and Hestia is not like that, but like she never gets Belle, you know? She's just a goddess. And then every, Belle gets a turn with like every other girl in different season and Hestia is always fucking benched. <laughs> Trials approaching. Oh. Freya's people. Yeah. <laughs> What? Dude, they're doing 20 reps of where's my hug. They're doing fucking 20 reps of please take my flower. What the fuck kind of training arc is this, bro? No, faster, quicker release. What are you doing? Because, <laughs> like, he, I'm, I'm assuming he's from Freya's side. And I, I, I guess it's for Seer. Freya and Seer, there's some kind of connection, right? And, and Bell is being trained so that he can be the best candidate? I don't fucking know how this is working. The date. Like, can you guys tell me? Because like, I haven't watched that much in a long fucking time. Even like season one content and season two is very hazy. In fact, I would kind of like to do a rewatch from the beginning. But like, this guy is on Freya's side, right? And like, why the fuck would someone on Freya's side, you know, go out of their way just for Seer a random bar girl? So like, clearly there is a connection with Freya and this girl. In fact, this girl pretty much looks like Freya, honestly, right? Again, no fucking spoilers, but her hair color, right? The personalities does not match, but like, it, it really resembles her to the thing, like to the point I could see like, maybe she's Freya's little sister. I don't know. <laughs> Poor Ryu. <laughs> you think he tra you think he trained him here too? <laughs> Come on. You have to say on. <laughs> Just give me ten reps of on. <laughs> you look great. <laughs> Do what? So you don't have to work at the fucking bar anymore? What do you what do you mean? Ma mama's gonna get mad. Yeah, or what? What is it? Ooh, more of Freya's men? I I'm I'm I don't I don't know. Any new character I'm seeing, I'm just guessing with Freya, but new character designs. I think it's new. Oh! Yo. And I forgot about her. She's just been... She, she low-key just benched too. Right? When was the last time 
When was the last time this girl, bro? How, when was the last time we had an intimate moment with her? Cause like, she obviously was one of the main girls that we were going with Ice, and then I think as soon as season two happened, the whole shit with Haruhime and stuff, and then Wine in season three. And then she was pretty much an antagonist for a bit, but then she turned out all right. Remember the whole thing with like Vina versus Ice and stuff? She is pretty much benched too, huh? Yeah, something, something, Valenstein. Ice, is, Ice and Hestia, they're just fucking drowning right now. Ryu got a little bit of highlight, and now it's Seer's turn, but Ice is looking nice here. <laughs> She's a criminal? Is she really a goddess? I mean, like, she looks like Seer. Like, look at her, right? The face, the hair is different, color is similar, but god damn, bro. God damn, is she really a goddess? Who are you referring to? Freya right now? Or are you talking about Seer? It's, it's kind of ambiguous, you know? Wait. Why don't I just check the voice actor? Right? Like, the same idea of checking... The fucking voice actor list for Veal Jew Grace in Tower of God Season 2 and checking Bomb. Can I not just check the voice actor of Seer and Freya and be like, hmm, okay, interesting. Goddess of Fertility arc, man. Like, just, let's take this bitch to the fucking super lower floors of the dungeon then. Yeah, let's go to where me and Ryu met. October 4th. And that's it, man. This trailer was actually so full of content. There was so much. It wasn't just random scenes with no dialogue. There is so much dialogue. For whatever reason, Seer is wanting to be in love with Belle, but... The actual point of this seems to be her getting kidnapped, wants Belle to take her away so that she can escape her life. I don't know what kind of life she's really lived. I know that she just kind of works at the bar with Ryu, but everyone has their own little backstory, and clearly it's related with Freya. So this is upcoming season is looking pretty good. The animation quality is fucking top-notch. The only unfortunate thing is, like, in our channel, due to copyright strikes... Fun fact, Damachi Season 2 is actually the one, the two copyright strikes I got on my original channel that I had to delete my channel due to, in my original channel. So Damachi is actually the reason why this channel exists now. But like the fourth season we got away and it was fine and I don't know what we're gonna do about season one, two, and three content that doesn't exist in our channel, but I'll figure something out. But season five is looking pretty hype and I'll be there on October.